In the mid-1990s, Terry Laswell was the head coach for the UNI women's basketball program as the Panthers transitioned into Division I. Terry has always had a passion for working in the field of education, and that led her to becoming an associate professor and administrator in UNI's College of Education. We spoke to Terry about her unique journey as a university coach and educator. In eighth grade, I had these two kind of crazy goals, and one of them was I wanted to be a Division I basketball coach, and the other one was that I wanted to earn my doctorate and work in teacher preparation. So I know that sounds crazy, like I'm, I kind of made that up after the fact, but really, that, those were my goals. But really, teaching was what was in my blood. So happy that I did it, and um, so excited to know that um, the goals are attainable. 2530, I was making a transition from being a high school teacher and coach to being a uh, college administrator in facilities and coaching, and then beyond that, went on to be um, a full-time assistant at Kansas State. But the teaching piece was still there, watching growth and seeing students move and athletes move from point A to point B. Um, I taught any chance that I got. If there was an opportunity to teach something that was uh, an extra credit that they didn't have a professor for, I would teach that if I could and I could fit it in. That was how that progressed and how the teaching just kept staying involved and um, again going back to really being taught as an undergrad that you're a teacher first and a coach second. I was here from 89 to 95. I probably grew more as a person during that time because we weren't winning conference championships. We weren't winning a lot that you could see anywhere. Northern Iowa really, in a lot of ways, was still transitioning from being a Division II program. And because of that, we had somewhat of a mentality of that in how we recruited, the resources we used to recruit, and a number of different items. We were still playing in the dome. I like challenge, but I had to accept it at a different level and sort of try to mix reality with dreaming to move things along a little bit. The thing that was true and still remains true are the student athletes that were here. And they truly were students first, athletes second. We developed, we had fun. I still have contact with a number of them. Um, so then I came back here in this position eight years ago. Um, it's been a great transition. It's one that's coming to an end fairly soon. Um, I can't believe that I'm even saying the word retiring, but I am. I'm doing that with a sense of um, being part of something very good and giving a lot of other folks opportunities to go and be part of something good as well.